Greetings friend, entrepreneur, and fellow business builder. I am the marketing master, Jim Ackerman, and this is Good, Bad, and Ugly Ads, YouTube's first and only two-way interactive business building channel that helps you get more customers who will pay you more money more often the fastest, easiest, most cost-effective way is possible. How do we actually accomplish this magic? Well, we teach you marketing principles and let you learn them on your own. So here's how it works. I'm going to show you a marketing specimen. You get to vote on why and if you think it's good, bad, or ugly. You get a chance to examine it. I want you to think about the reasons why you vote the way you vote. Is it good and why, bad or why, ugly and why, okay? Then after you voted, you get to hear from me and I tell you my vote and why I think it was either good, bad or ugly based on sound, profit proven, cash generating marketing principles. Intrigued? Hope so. All right, here we go. This is today's specimen. It is a simple number 10 envelope. It has a funky little Norman Rockwellian picture beneath or uh, on it that says, we're still looking for you. Well, what does that mean? Intriguing. If you feel it, it has a little bit of lumpiness to it. So let's find out what's inside. And here is what pops out. This is a little magnifying glass, like you might get in Cracker Jacks, that is attached to the top of this letter. It is a front and back sales letter, and it says, what's the difference between ordinary and extraordinary when it comes to printing, direct mail, and marketing services, and then in such small type that you have to use that little magnifying glass, it says, it's that little extra. When you look at this letter, you're going to see that this two-color effort is a very classic direct mail approach to gain some business. Take a close look, and if you can, pause the video and read the copy. And give me your impression of whether you think this is good, bad, or ugly. You give me that impression by after you have paused the video, coming back here and casting your vote. So, is this direct mail piece from the printer good, bad, or ugly?